it's Robert for Road to Beer and Race, Race 5 here at California Speedway, Auto Club Speedway. And I qualify 40th while Dale Jr. qualified first. I'll be charging my. I don't even know where is my charger. Guys, I've been amazing. How's your guys' day going? It's like my. My go. I'll try to win this race for you guys. There's no guarantees. There we go, guys. Um, Advocare Ford Fusion. I see Mac Tools. Sherwin Williams. That's all I can see. But here we go. Race five of thirty-six. Hopefully we can win. But I've been struggling. Green flag is out here at Auto Club Speedway. Just got into Eric Albert Roller right there. He checked up right in front of me. Oh, you're I have a feeling it's going to be a really good race here. As long as we don't wreck. Pretty good run through there. Go be the last one of 40 here at California Speedway. I know it's Auto Club, but I like calling it California. Wow, three wide, four wide here. Closing it on McMurray here. Slingshot. Completed two laps here at California Speedway. You know, this track is really flat and it causes a lot of grooves. You know, you can go up, up high, down low, or hit the wall. Thank you, Ryan Newman, and the Quicken Loans RCR 31 here. Give him room. So we're in 30th position after three laps here at Auto Club Speedway. Slightly touched Regan uh, Smith right there. Thank you, Ryan Newman, for giving me room. We have my teammate Greg Biffle in the lead here. Good job. Really good. Wow, we moved up to 21st in that one corner. Four laps have been completed. They're wrecking. And they seem to gather it back up themselves. We're gonna go inside here with Trix Jr. for furniture row racing. I'm doing my best, sir. So five laps have been completed here at Auto Club Speedway. Car's kind of tight going in, but we seem to be moving up pretty fine. Had to check up right there. AJ Allmendinger just got up right there on me, and I had to check up my teammate in the Fast Enough Ford Fusion. Seems to have a run on the inside, and I'll block, block him down low. I 
I should have expected that. Hold on. Great. Alright, we're fine. We're fine. What was I thinking? Look look what I did. I went up on him and then he clipped the wall. That's totally my fault. Hope you guys enjoyed that ride right there. Of course I'm gonna pit. I'm gonna make this car looser, but I need to make if I'm gonna make a looser car, I have to also do the opposite. So like a lot of cars are pitting here. It's good for us. I'm surprised not more cars are pitting. It's, um I want to say almost half the field pitted right there. I think we'll be fine. That's take. That's my fault entirely with Joey Logano. Let's do this real quick. I'm not gonna add more tape. No way. Make an adjustment. Make a small wedge. Let's get the front a little different here. We're gonna. I'm making a lot of swings. Well, I'm making huge swings right now. Let's go down the track bar more. Let's go more down the rears, and we should be fine. We should be fine. We made a lot of adjustments, rear, front. We build champions. Awesome. Alright, hopefully these adjustments will work. Greg Biffle is the leader and I will be in last. It looks like we have a good car to move up to the front. We made it up to about the top top 20. You see it right there, we made it to top 16. So we should be able to do a good job moving up front with the fresher tires and more fuel. So first we start here, let's go. Had to check up right there. Looks like Kyle Busch didn't get a good restart. Four wide. In the turn one, side by side with Austin Dillon, JJ Ailey, and Trevor Bain. Looks like we're going to go with uh, Jimmy Johnson in the 48. Huge check up by Justin Allgaier and Jimmy Johnson. Looks like Eric Avarola checks up and gets into Jamie McMurray. More grip for me. Thank you. We're gonna go four wide. Clear. Just past Tony Store for 30th. Oh, this car handles way better. Big wreck in front of me. Looks like uh, Cole Witt has to check up and he gets on the outside, passing Chase Elliott here on the inside, down the back straightaway with nine laps completed here at Auto Club Speedway. Excuse me, Michael Annette. And look. A base a move, remove, remove the, a base of moves right there by me, Trevor Bain. Looks like Denny Howland is your leader with 10 laps completed in the turn one. Hard. Too hard. Thank you. I got into Michael Annette and I think someone hit me. Yep. Ugly. Side skirt looks pretty good. We got a pit. We have some damage on the right front. Hopefully we didn't kill the car. Again, I'm happy with the car. I just got to be careful with the AI. The AI, is really, the AI is really squirrely here. So we really need to be careful. 
I was trying to be careful with Michael and Ned because I knew if I pushed Michael and Ned, I didn't want to cause a caution. That's why I backed off. I could have just throttled it up, but it looks like he was going to go up the track, and I didn't want to deal with that. It's not too bad. I'm not going to make any adjustments. I'm happy with the car. I'm just going to get the right front fixed, and we should be okay. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the race. This race has been really intense. A lot of the AIs are moving around, spinning out. I caused a couple wrecks. I got I got into Joey Logano, and then I got into Michael Annette recently here. No adjustments, four tires and fuel, and we should be on our way. I'm not too concerned about track position until it's like 15 to go. Because we haven't gone through a full fuel run or a tire run. Uh, we should be able to make up these positions real easily. Okay, Brian Vickers is your leader. It looks like I'll be back in last again. Um, car seems pretty good, so I'm happy about that. I gotta be careful on this restart. The last, the last restart, there was a checkup with Kyle Busch, so I gotta be really conservative here. Lap 12 and 40. Looks like I'll be able to pass these guys cleanly. Outside of Kyle Bush or Kurt Bush. I would swoop down to the bottom, but there should be no danger ahead to right now. Catsy, 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 catsy. I couldn't see crap. There was already a wreck happening, oh my gosh. I couldn't see crap. I'm not pitting. 30 second. I don't know why not a lot of people pitted. I gotta be careful. One, because I don't know who wrecked. I hope there's nobody on the... I'm gonna stay on the bottom this time. If I can get to the bottom, I'll, I'll do it. Ooh, no, no. Well, that wasn't the start I wanted. There better be not. I hope not. I'm looking ahead. Oh, he should be fine. I don't know how Michael and Ed is still alive. I could have pitted, but we just pitted the last caution, so I don't see the problem. Wow, just past Mike, just past uh, Eric Amarola and my teammate Stenhouse Jr. Hey, you see how everybody's just sliding? Wow, four wide here. You see how I'm being really conservative? I don't want to get into anybody. Wow. I'm not covering hitting on this part because we're going five wide. 16 laps have been completed here at California Speedway. Ooh, the run. Cole Witt and I are getting here. Passing Jeff Gordon for 11. Excuse me, Chase Elliott and McMurray. Gotta crack the top five here.
Alright, we're moving down to 6 with 17 laps completed here at Auto Club Speedway. Wow, okay, now I can start commentating here. Side by side with Chase Elliott in the Napa Auto Parts Chevrolet SS 25 car for Hendrick Motorsports. I'm Trevor Bain in the Ford Fusion 6 for Roush Fenway Racing Advocare. Completed lap 18 of 40 in the lap 19. Looks like we have a six car breakaway. I do see a couple of drivers still battling it out right there. Not sure who that is, but I think I see a yellow car. I'm gonna assume that's Joey Logano up front. I'm, I'm trying not to push it because I'm Yes, I want to go up front, but I think patience is going to be a key here. I haven't been patient the last couple races, or the last season in general, you know. I'm just going to try to reel these guys in. I'm going to try our best, and I hope we can win. Oh, well, it looks like we have a slow car. I think that's Denny Hamlin there. We're gonna get rid of him and Chase Elliott here. Hopefully, ooh. Ooh, good save. Almost got on to Chase Elliott there. Not gonna let that happen with me and Joey Logano again. Gonna go below the apron. That's that's legal. I'm not really side drafting. I think I'm gonna try to earn everybody's respect here. I know it's not really going to make a huge difference the next race, but hit the apron right there. Kind of messed up my exit and mid-entry. Should be able to keep going. I don't know if it, anybody can make it from this point on. We have, everyone seems to be spread it out. It looks like the second place car Seems to be doing really good. Race looks like the, the third place car is going on the inside. Can he complete the pass? They're still side by side. I believe that's Paul Menard up ahead. Joey Logano is your leader. Side by side down the back straightaway. We're still. Looks like Chase Elliott and I are catching them up. I'm gonna make an adjustment. The car's tied under braking. So I should be able to do good. I'm not worried about Hamlin. He's like a second behind. 22 laps completed here at Auto Club Speedway. Oh, well, looks like everyone's catching up to each other. Everybody seems to be in a straight line. I don't know who's in second, but he's getting a run. So I chase the has caught up to, to the third place, and we have a change for six. Casey Mears. I'm catching up, so I might be doing something right. I do see another car pitting. A lap car's ahead. Yeah, car's just tight under braking. So I'm not catching up to Chase Elliott or the other drivers right now. I feel like I'm, be I'm better in turn one though, than turn three and four. Seems like I'm able to hold the middle lane pretty well, but I'm not catching Elliot. I'm actually losing time. All right, it's too early for me to pit, but I want to go through a full run because 
It's like Joey Lagarde. No, nope, that's not Joey Lagarde. That's Michael Annette right there. Excuse me. Labarney for third. All right. Remember, me and Joey Logano got in that first caution, so looks like we made up pretty well. I think Paul Menard's probably going to pit this time. Nope, he is not. Labani, he's pitting, so he will relinquish fourth. And Denny Hamlin will take over the fourth position. Now a sea of cars have decided to pit. Wow, Michael Annette. He got out. I'm not gonna pit till I run out of fuel. And I'm thinking of taking just fuel. It seems like a good way to go. I should probably pit this time. I don't want to lose any more time to the leaders. But I do want to get maximum fuel. So it's like a risk versus reward kind of gamble. And the car is getting better throughout the run, so. What do you think? Should we pit? I'll pit. I'm not going to make any adjustments. The car seems pretty good, to be honest. I don't see Joey Logano. Should be heading out pit road right now. Should be Johnson and Truex Jr. decide to stay out. Kenseth. We should be fine. We're gonna take fuel only. This is our guy I'm gonna take. We should be out of here in no time. Awesome. I don't know what happened there. Put this in fourth gear, dang. Oh, battling for the lead. Me and Joey Logano, he passes me clearly. Wow. I don't know why the caution didn't come out that time. I'm surprised it didn't. Car's tight though. And he has pressure tires too. Woo, three wide. Hmm. Get rid of him. I hope I have a good car. The car was good throughout the run. That's why I, didn't, I decided to make no adjustments. I feel like the car was good enough to, um... Oh man, I, I didn't want to regret my decision by not taking tires. The car is uber tight, guys. It's really tight under braking. I took a risk. Oh my gosh, Joey Logano's like gone too. Clearing Labani here. I don't know how I'm gonna get to Logano. Now uh, takes over the lead here on lap 31. We move up to four. 
Wow. I really want to win this race. Ugh, five seconds and like nine laps. Even if I back off the corner early, I'm still losing a lot of time. I hope he has less fuel than me. I'm gonna lose three tenths. That's why. Ugh. I don't think we're gonna win, guys. It's kind of impossible. If a caution comes out, that'd be helpful. How is Bobby Labani this far ahead? Oh, that was a good corner right there. Casey Mears seems to pass Spyro Labani. I'm pushing it. This is the run that we do need, but a win would definitely help me. Casey Ramirez had a good run off the corner of four. Can't seem to get the power down in the center. I'm kind of hoping for a caution. I know Joy Lagarde doesn't want to see that. He's going to have a run in here. Casey Mears has a good run again. I gotta move up. I need a huge pull. Or a push from Casey Mears here. Side by side. It's a good run, a good run. Well, I was gonna go chop him down, but it's like Bobby Labani has a run on Casey Mears, passes him on the outside with two to go as we cross the line here. Messed up this corner, but I'm gonna block his high lane. And Casey Kane has a run. Surprising him to swoop down low to go to the bottom. He had a run. 
Side by side, I think that's Michael Waltrip. Wow. Looks like we're heading into the final lap here. Final lap here at Auto Club Speedway. I was hoping for a caution, but it did not happen. Ooh, someone gets into the wall. I had the block right there. Joey Logano wins at Auto Club Speedway. And off of turn four, we're going to finish fifth. The fourth. Sorry. That's what I said. I'm the ticker. Solid. Solid top five again. That's really going to help your point totals a lot. You know, not the way we wanted to finish this race. I think we could have won this race clearly. It's just spun off a of pit road, and I think that that I think that would have made a huge difference. Um, I the, I don't know what was the AI thinking. The car just spun out. I didn't even do nothing. So that's what I'm really frustrated about right now. But we finished pretty well. Um, there's your results right there. Michael and that finished his last while. Joy Logano wins. So, I think that's the one that, that got away. So I'm going to remember that one. Next couple races, we're probably going to struggle. I think the next race is Martinsville, and then we go on to Texas after that. So, maybe we can bunch off a win off Texas, and then we should be fine. If we keep knocking off top 5s and top 20s and top 30s. You know, the car was really good, but under braking, we just couldn't get the car to roll in the center. You know, that was just the biggest problem. We only gained one position. But, um, you know, we're not too far from behind. We're less than... We're less than 30 points behind of Eric Amarola. I want to say 26. So we should be fine, but we're going to struggle at Martinsville. So I think that we're going to scratch that race right away. And then the next race after that, we're going to Texas. And I assume we will do good there. Bristol, we will struggle. Richmond will struggle. So, yeah. this t Around this time, we always seem to struggle. But, you know, this California top five is going to really, hopefully, give me some confidence going into Texas. All right. So we're heading into Martinsville. It's Rowan for Rowan's Review and Race. Hope you guys enjoyed the race. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Have a wonderful, wonderful. We finally finished really good. We finished in the top five day. Love and peace, guys. Y'all take it easy. Much love.